Where is that preacher? He had a flat tire. Well, why aren't you out there fixing it? Darling, relax. He's a man of God. Why, he can probably heal that tire. The sooner we get hitched, the sooner we get rid of Laura. He'll never take Luke away from me. <laughs> you just watch. Reverend Estrada's here. Reverend. Now we're ready to rock. Yes, yes, indeed. Reverend Estrada, oh, I was about to give up on you. And me, I offer my most sincere apologies. I got here as soon as I could. Are you always this laid back about weddings, Reverend? I had uh, car trouble, my son. Well, Padre, an excuse is an excuse. You shouldn't keep people waiting on the most important day of their lives. What can I tell you? Even a man of God must sometimes get a flat tire. Who is this? My wife, Blanca. She is here to uh, bear witness to the ceremony and to provide the music. Well, I heard that your wife was mousy and drab. And come to think of it, I also heard that you were a lot shorter than this, Reverend. Well, I was. It's uh, a miracle. Oh. So what's the story? I object to the word Massey, and I tried to dress appropriately Dear. as the wife of the man of the cloth. And, you do. and yes, it is true. He is no longer short. It's a miracle. May I suggest a respectful silence at this joyous occasion, Blanca. How can it be joyous when the bride has the place filled with armed thugs and the groom is handcuffed? My goodwill is wearing real thin. Oh, I ignore her, darling. Concentrate on us. All right. I'm going to go back to the main house and slip into my wedding gown. Oh, I'll be waiting here, chomping at the bed. <laughs> In just a mere moment or two, I'll be all yours, sugar bug. Reverend, get things ready. Yeah. Come on, boys. Honey, cue up that wedding march. I got here as soon as Ellen gave me the message. That that Jennifer chick is seriously smitten, dude. She is crazy. Yeah, well, not to mention her gun-toting goons. Yeah. yeah, that one Abe is really itching to put a bullet in Luke. We've got to come up with something fast. Well, looks like they're going to be busy up at the big house for a while. Well, why don't we just make a run for it? No, look, Laura, that won't work, darling. They're armed, and they're perfectly capable of hunting us down like dogs. You don't happen to have a SWAT team on you, do you? We are the cavalry. Well, okay. Laura had a pretty good idea. Yeah? You know, with a couple of tweaks here and there, it just might work. Let's hear it. All right, the minute the ceremony is over. Why are you doing this? Because I'm in love with Jennifer, don't you understand? No, I don't. You're engaged to me. You can't marry that awful woman. I gotta follow my heart. You should understand that. Hey, 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 break it out, hey, break it out. Hey, Listen, get I'm your hands you. off me. You better be so. <laughs> nice punches. Nice kick. Yeah, get him somewhere out of sight. Give me a second. One down, two to go. Let's keep this roll going. Yeah. Hey, uh, can you really play that thing? I know two songs really well. Cool. I stashed them under a cactus. Good, let's hope he stays there. The bride's ready. All right, everyone take your places. Turn over here. Mm -hmm. And you here. All right, Abe, all right.
Jenny Bell, you look gorgeous. I do, don't I? Uh, Miss Jennifer, uh, if you'll permit me. There's not going to be a problem, is there, Padre? One small problem. My holy orders expressly forbid conducting a wedding where anyone has been coerced. I don't like the sound of this. Meaning simply, I cannot proceed while anyone is in handcuffs. Well, I was going to take them off. Eventually. <laughs> Go ahead, Abe. Let's get to work. Ah, uh, un momentito más, por favor. Ah, uh, I mean, I can't have anyone in handcuffs. And that includes the lady. You're a real stickler for the rules, aren't you? It's a weakness. You heard him, Abe. Go ahead. Satisfied? <laughs> Completely, my daughter. Thank you. All right, well, let's get this show yeah, on the road. <laughs> oh, just one last thing before we get started. Anything at all, woman of my dreams. Well, I just want you to know that if this day doesn't wind up with you and me in the wedding bed, Abe here has orders to take care of Laura. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here together in the sight of God to join this man and this woman in holy matrimony. For richer or poorer, although we won't be having to worry about that, Peaches, in sickness and in health, till death, do us part. Mm, beautiful. Now you, you may now begin your vows. Uh, <clears throat> I, Lucas Lorenzo Spencer, take thee, Jennifer Elizabeth Francesca Smith Boggs Smith. Oh. <gasps> ah! What? Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh. 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 children. Oh. 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 You think she did permanent damage? We can only pray. You snake! You ruined my wedding again! Why did you stop her? She moved like grease lightning. I'd rather put him in the hospital than let you have him. You'll get yours. How's he doing? Not good. He needs a doctor immediately. Oh, Cosimo, get Luke in the truck. Yes. Yes. Uh, and a one, one and two, a two, three. three. Oh. Ah! Oh. Ah! 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 I knew you weren't a priest. Come on, darling. We'll never get through the river down there. Let's go this way. Gotcha! <laughs> Luke, don't touch her. Or your face will be the last thing she sees. <laughs> 